Guys, big injection mistake. I see you with peptides like GHKCU, glutathione, quarantine. People say it burned, so I'm just gonna go ahead and add more bacteriostatic water. But there's a few issues with that. Number one, more bacteriostatic water is almost always gonna be adding more alcohol. That burns and it's an irritant. And then number two, you're actually adding more volume, which leads to more tissue stretch under the skin. So now you have a larger deposit, which is a great recipe for for a delayed ache one to 12 hours later. So here's the kind of key diagnosing. One, if it's burning while going in, that's usually a pH or osmolarity. So diluting may or may not help. Also, hopefully you alcoholed the area before you injected and that can burn as when you're injecting the alcohol goes into the skin. Now, if there's more of a delayed achiness, that's usually some form of inflammation from fluid shift. It can be allergy or a histamine type response. So a few tips I do with my patients is one, I let the alcohol dry. Two, I tell them to inject slowly. Three, we try and keep the volume low. Four, we rotate injection locations. Five, we get the injection to room temperature. And sometimes if you really need it, you can add a cold pack to the area. Now, correct me if I'm wrong in the comments below. If you've used some of these things and you've experienced painting or burning and you got rid of them, besides using like lidocaine, what actually worked for you?